Well, good morning everyone and welcome to Monday's Thought for the Day. At this time our hearts are deeply saddened at the death of Tony, a much loved member of our church family. Tony is safe with the Lord, but there is grief among us. So it's right that we turn to the scriptures. And in John 11, the apostle records Mary's grief when her brother Lazarus dies. John chapter 11, verses 33 to 36. When Jesus saw her weeping, and the Jews who had come along with her also weeping, he was deeply moved in spirit and troubled. Where have you laid him? he asked. Come and see, Lord, they replied. Jesus wept. Then the Jews said, See how he loved him. Mary cries. She is overcome with grief at her brother's death. Her friends cry with her. When death comes, we need friends to weep with us, to walk with us through the dark days. Jesus cries too at the death of his friend. We simply read in verse 35, Jesus wept. It's the shortest verse in the Bible. We see the humanity of Jesus. He loves and he weeps. Jesus is not remote from the sufferings of his fellow humans. He understands the deep sense of loss and grief that we all experience in the face of death. And as we go through this Holy Week, there will be many tears shed across this nation. And it's good to know, therefore, that Jesus cares and grieves at the brokenness of our world. But Jesus also does something about it. And tomorrow I will speak of the resurrection hope we have in the midst of tears. But for now, let's pray. Almighty God, Father of all mercies and giver of all comfort, be with those who mourn, that casting all their cares on you, they may know your deep love today through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Have a good Monday. See you tomorrow.